Today we're going to be reviewing a software called Yahoo Widgets and uh, pretty much enables you to upload widgets onto your desktop much like Mac's uh, operating system does. You can use this with Mac too and it's real nice. Uh, I use it for Windows XP which you can't really tell I have Alienware's skin on but you can switch Oh, well, let's we'll start with the weather here. You can switch through uh, zip codes real easy. That's quick. You can add a new zip code real easy. Just type it in here or a city name. And uh, the weather thing's nice. I like that. That's a Yahoo widget, I believe. It's produced by Yahoo. This one is just a graph, more graphical icon for your recycling bin, which is nice. Uh, there's no lag in moving any of these around and it actually uses hardly any RAM I'm using 19 percent but I have Windows Media Player running I have the, I'm in the process of recording right now I have a control panel for my sound card so it's uh, surprisingly low on resource using uh, my CPU here it's about 50 so 55% used up because I'm recording so it has nothing to do with the program really over here you have your widget management system I guess you could call it like you can close this widget and then you go right back in here go into your recent widgets find it open it up that's pretty sweet it's uh, real easy to use real easy to figure out and you can pick you know where you want to dock the sidebar which is cool you can just have all kinds of, they even have a product tour here if you don't know how to use it just pretty much watch these videos and uh, figure it out which I don't think hardly anyone would need that or at least not me and here's a let's see what this is. It's a, a notepad. You sign into your Yahoo account, and then you can just here's a just one I made. Just playing around with it. You can just make notes, just like sticky notes, pretty much. That's pretty cool. Oh uh, well, I guess I'd give this software a 10 out of 10 it looks great it's easy to use it's you know low on resources uh, yeah I give it a 10 out of 10 I wouldn't recommend it for Mac because their widgets obviously look great in their software so uh, you could use it in conjunction with their widgets if they didn't offer something you would like that would be pretty nice but yeah especially for Windows it's a uh, I haven't messed with Vista much but I think they look just as good or better than the gadgets that come with Vista. So tell me what you think. Stop by the website here and uh, or leave me a comment on YouTube and see if you use. It. I want to I want to know if you guys use this software and uh, how you guys like it. Yep, that's about it. I thank you for your time.